this video I will show you how to find the centroid of inverted T-shape object like in this video you are seeing on the left side there is inverted T-shape dimensions are given of all sides and um, to find the centroid of inverted T-shape uh, of any object we would use the below formula the y bar is equal to summation of areas and to y bar divided by summation of areas the product of areas into y divided by the summation of areas so now i'm um, calculating the areas of the object there's the two object different object the first one is a1 the below flange it's uh, two centimeter and multiply by 10 centimeter and the area of the below object 20 cent square centimeter area of the first object now I'm calculating the area of the second object that you can see that is the whip type object 15 into 1.5 equal to 22.5 square centimeter Now I will show you the y bar distance of each object. Uh, as we can see, the form in the formula y bar is used. So I will calculate the y bar of first object and the y bar of second object. The y one I am denoting the centroid of first object by y one, and the centroid of the second object should be from the base of the a reference to the centroid of the second object uh, as uh, denoted by y2 now I'm writing here y1 is, e is equal to uh, one centimeter because uh, the centroid of this object can be easily find two by one now I'm going to find y2 and it's equal to and the two centimeter plus 15 divided by two it's equal to 7.5 so the centroid of the second object comes out to be 9.5 two plus 7.5 equal to 9.5 centimeter is the centroid of the second object now I'm putting all these values in the main equation so y is equal to the a1 into y1 which is equal to the 20 cross 1 centimeter plus a2 into y2 that is a2 a is 22.5 square centimeter and multiply by the y2 9.5 So I'm now dividing it. Wait, I've made some mistakes here. Is the plus sign while the two plus seven point five is equal to nine point five. So I'm just removing the addition sign and putting the equal sign. Sorry for this. let's come to the main formula uh, so now I'm dividing this by the summation of the areas there's a1 plus a2 uh, is we will find the areas of the two objects a1 plus a2 that is the 20 plus 22.5 uh, I just pushed uh, put the above values in the main equation so the, now the centroid will be equal to the I'm multiplying on calculator and, uh, this is so two one three point seven five plus twenty. I just simplified it by calculating the above values and dividing by 
simply 42.5 yes yes it's equal to 42.5 now coming again y is equal to the I'm going to add these two values and dividing by 42.5 it uh, comes out to be 5.5 centimeter yes so I'm showing you that this is now the centroid of this inverted T shape this is the now answer of our inverted T shape the centroid of inverted T shape I'm now showing you by drawing it from the reference from the base to the uh, up to the distance of 5.5 from the reference to the distance of 5.5 centimeter this is our centroid of this whole and what it is shape object and I'm representing I'm showing you writing uh, it like y is equal to 5.5 centimeter right this is now 5.5 and uh, this is the centroid of this object and it's very easy to find the centroid of any object and uh, please subscribe our channel for more videos thank you